RES District 5. up for a tough question, but uh, rest assured, I'm going to ask 
the next group of panelists the same question. This is a group that's going to have a great impact on the national election. And so the question to you is, if you were invited to an LGBT group meeting, would you accept? Now, for those of you that don't know that acronym, it's Lesbian, Gay, Bisexual, Transgender Group. And that's a moving force in this country. And so would you accept uh, an invitation to meet with that group? I've already answered that question. I said I represent everybody in the city of Valdez. We may not agree on a kid of lifestyle choice, but I represent everybody in Valdez. And if that person happens to be gay or lesbian, then I represent them too. That was not a tough question. Jobs. Now, granted, this was a few years ago, but I think it's indicative 
of the kind of work that we're doing and who we can look forward to in the future. And that business is Martin's Famous Pastry. Martin's Famous Pastry is located here because of our water and our sewer system. And with it, they brought good paying jobs, average paying benefits of $54,000 a year. And it was because of the quality of our water and the quality of our wastewater treatment process that gave them a reason to select Valasco as their home and with them some really good paying jobs. That's the kind of leadership that it takes, that's the kind of collaboration it takes, and that's the kind of work you're going to get out of me in another four years. Now, one last thing, she have stood up here. <laughs> when, when you look at the choices that we have to make, <laughs> I think, oh, you stuck up. All right, I'm going to get the bell. My name is Tim Carroll. I am here asking for your voting support again, and I thank you very much. <laughs> 30 more seconds. I think what's most important in this election, I see this election as a tipping point for our community. We're going to make some big decisions. We're going to make a big decision for mayor. We're going to make a big decision for council seats. Every incumbent is challenged. Now, I'm not going to stand here and I can't campaign for a single individual, but I think the point I want to make is this is an important year in our city. And I think that folks like you, getting out, listening and hearing, learning what everybody stands for is critically important, and I wish you would carry the message out to all those that have not been attending that it's time to pay attention and get out and vote. Thank you very much.